In the mid-1930s, as the shadow of war loomed over Europe, Britain was gripped by a terrifying fear, aerial attack. The Air Ministry, desperate for a solution, offered a 1,000-pound prize for anyone who could invent a death ray, a weapon capable of killing a pilot or disabling an aircraft from miles away. The challenge was taken up by radio physicist Robert Watson Wacht. He and his colleague Arnold Wilkins quickly calculated that a destructive beam was impossible with current technology. The power acquired would be astronomical. However, they proposed an alternative. Instead of destroying an aircraft with radio waves, what if they could simply detect it? In February 1935, they conducted the Daventry Experiment. Using a BBC shortwave transmitter as their source, they successfully detected radio waves bouncing off a Royal Air Force bomber flying nearby. The blip on their screen wasn't a weapon, but it was a warning. This was the birth of what would become the Chain Home Radar System, the invisible shield that would prove decisive in the upcoming Battle of Britain, turning the failed quest for a death ray into one of history's most vital inventions.